Hey, what's up YouTube? I just want to give you a quick rundown on how to build a bait tube out of PVC pipe that uh, trolls along behind your kayak. It's a simple, easy way that you don't have to deal with something that's really big behind you dragging around like one of those little uh, yellow live bait tanks. So what I'm going to do is take some 4-inch PVC pipe, two end caps, and a screw-on cap, and make a pull behind PVC bait tube. All we got is a 4-inch piece of sewer pipe. PVC will do, whatever, as long as it's 4 inch. I mean, that seems to be the, the, the best size for um, the larger baits, like your hardtails and stuff. So, 4 inch pipe right there. Over here we got an end cap from Lowe's, 4 inch drain cap. We got uh, a 4 inch. Uh, sewer and drain PVC adapter this is actually going to slide on the outside of it and then we got an end cap right here and then some uh, all-purpose cement for PVC so I think I got like 10 bucks in this and then I found the sewer pipe at the house and I'm going to cut a piece about like 36 inches and then to put these caps on there, glue it together, put about 50 holes in it with the uh, drill down the side, and then spray paint it. And I'm going to have a quick, easy uh, pull behind uh, bait tube. So stay tuned. It's going to be good to go. About 40 inches all around. Ba boom! Bait tank right there. Guys, now I'm gonna let it dry and then come back and glue it. Alright, the, uh, the sewer pipe or the piece of pipe is dried, okay? Now I'm gonna put the cement on it, put the caps on, and drill the holes. So, see 40 inches here or there, give it a little bit. Big enough to, uh, Facilitate just about any bait, probably like maybe five or six mullet, a few hardtails, a whole bunch of pinfish, big, little, whatever. Alright, time for the glue. All purpose PVC glue. If I can open it. Here, put on the inside of the cap, just like this. All the way around. Take a little more. Get back on. Stick it on like this here. Pound it on. Boom! One cap on. Good to go. Move over to the next. Dry it off. Just like that. In cap right here. Give me some glue on here, all over the inside, as far as I can get it, see, all over the inside, take some more, put it around the edges here, be liberal with this glue now, because Why not? That's what you bought it for, right? Put it on here. Just like this. Boom. End cap on. Alright, now you got bait tank. Both end caps on. Now I'm gonna drill the holes all the way down here and up here. And we'll have a tank. 
Make sure you close your glue. I'm just kind of spitballing on the drill size here. Totally got this drill at a yard sale for five bucks. Works just good, isn't works good as can be. Five bucks. Getting a little rusty though. Sucker on there, chuck it down, hook me up some power. Now, I'm going to take and drill a hole right through here. Hopefully, I go all the way through for my cord to hang out all the way around. It's going to come out into a V right here. Let's see how this goes. Right through that sucker. It's like that. Too easy. Just gonna run it right through there. Just gonna go around the end of this tube. Put some more holes in this. Bad boy. What I got here is just a piece of 550 cord. Piece, this is just a piece of paracord. Just run it through the hole here. Boom. And boom. Just 
gonna do some knots here, spitballing us. It should work. This whole thing is my idea of what it should be. Just like that. Throw another knot in the bottom of this. Just had this cord laying around, figured it would work. Alright, boom, look at that. This is almost an end product right here. Just like that. Pull it from this little loop right here. Right behind the kayak. And we got a bait tube. Hope there's enough holes. I mean, that should float slash sink slash keep fish alive, right? I'm guessing. I guess we'll find out tomorrow, right? Yeah, buddy. Go. Got a 100% bait tube right there. Got a... Uh, just gonna pull it right behind the kayak. It should be easy. Don't have to worry about uh, a big parachute pulling behind you. And, uh, but it definitely keep the bait alive probably a lot better than that, that live bait tank. Or the, uh, the little yell pull behind, you know, the ones that drop off the side of the bridge and just floats. It should be way better than that. So. See how it works. You know, if you got any other ideas, put it in the comments below. Don't forget to like me on Facebook at Yak Motley. And uh, follow me on Instagram. Check, uh, at, follow me on Instagram. It's that. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Yak Motley. Twitter Jack Motley Live. And, uh, you know, don't be afraid to comment. Give me, uh, give me your own opinions on stuff. And uh, way we can make this kayak fishing stuff better. So see you later.